She is so triggered that I choose to be fit for my man. Y'all don't see the mental illness that is going on in our society today. Hey guys, welcome back to More to Life. Now, thanks for coming. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to check out my other content. We have it coming. And also, leave a like and a comment. And a lot of my people that are watching my videos are only new people only. So, subscribers, be sure to click the notification bell so you get notified when the videos are dropping. Let's keep it going. All right, now today we're gonna react to this. Now, this lady here is being hated on by other women, okay? And what's happening right now in the West, and it's been happening for a while, if a woman wants to be fit, feminine, and friendly, or if a woman wants to cook for her man, she's put down for it. A woman being called pick -me's. And that's what happened with this woman here. She was called the pick -me, and not even just the pick -me, she was hated on for doing what she needs to do for a man. But let's get right into it, guys. I want to be fit, feminine, and friendly for my man. You heard that? The woman is on her platform for three days upset because she wants to be fit, feminine, and friendly for her man. And here's what the lady said. This lady here said, yes, I have a being fit. Doesn't stop the ones who want to cheat. Stay fit for yourself. You slow as F. Told her she's slow. Sad. Let's get into this. She is so triggered that I choose to be fit for my man. Y'all don't see the mental illness that is going on in our society today? We see it. My man. I want to be fit for my man and she is mad. Yeah, and this is something that's happening in the West, right? And the lady that's saying this, she, she called the girl slow. You're slow as F. And that's not slow. She wants to keep her husband, you know, she, or if it's not her husband yet, she wants to keep her man so he can turn it to her husband. I think she's on the right path. You know, there's still women out there that are on that on that path and saying, you know what, I want to do what it takes to keep my man. I want to keep my man pleased. I want to keep my man happy. And as you see here, no offense to my woman in the U.S., but this woman is obviously from the Caribbean. So makes a lot of sense. Makes a lot of sense. And we're going to get into this. I'm going to actually watch the video that the lady headed on. Now, it's a video of this woman working out. Let's take a look at that. Yeah. Kevin Samuel said men want their woman fit, feminine, friendly. She's going hard, man. Look at that. You go, sister. Man, did y'all see her going? <laughs> she was going hard. And she had there on the screen, she had Kevin Samuel said men want their woman fit, feminine, friendly. And I see where the hate's coming from. You know where the hate's coming from? It's because she mentioned Kevin Samuels. She said Kevin Samuels said men want their woman fit, feminine, and friendly. She's triggered because the lady wrote Kevin Samuels said it. You know what happened? She was watching Kevin Samuels and listened. She took heat to it. And she said, you know what? She seemed like she was already fit. She went harder. I can tell. She went harder and said, you know what? <laughs> she had it right there. Kevin Samuel said, men want their women fit, feminine, and friendly. And, and what this lady's heading on, she's triggered by Kevin Samuels. Just because you aren't taking anything from it. Just because you haven't probably even watched him. You know, some of his biggest haters haven't even watched his video. I remember when I first... Heard about him. I heard he was doubting woman. I was stuck on that that simp attitude, and then I watched him. I didn't just judge and say, "Oh, Kevin Samuels, why you bashing woman?" I watched, and I already knew what he was talking about. Like when he, when he was talking about that, I was already out in the Philippines. Like I've been out here seven years, married to my wife, so I already seen what was happening in America. I already made that move myself. So when he was talking about it, in my head, it was like, "Okay, I'm already married to a woman out here," and of course, you know, I got hate from it one day, but that's fine. I don't care what anybody says. But more props to this woman. There needs to be more sisters like her. But you know what? The ones that are like her in the U.S., they're getting called pick-me's. They're getting called all kinds of things. They're getting called 
maids, like the women in the Philippines here get called maids, the women that are in the U.S. get called pick-me's, the women in other countries, uh, the Dominican Republic and or Colombia, whatever it may be, they're called maids too. The girl is going to come over and then she's going to leave you and I think we make enough money to, to get these women attracted to us. It's crazy. The things you're hearing nowadays is crazy. And it's just clear evidence of why men are leaving. And I'm sure there's women that are smart. There's women that are seeing these videos. And there's women that are seeing our videos. And then there's women that are taking a step back and saying, wait a minute. When I was in Jamaica last week, honey, every other couple was a black man with a different race of woman. Spanish, Asian, white, girl. Uh, uh, honey, please, y'all better focus on the right shit. Y'all better start taking care of your man because, honey, they are leaving. I see why these guys are leaving. There's a lot of women out there that are, that are saying, I see why these guys are leaving. And it's crazy that women are going through it, too. So you don't want to change. You would rather bash us. You're making them bash women that are changing and keep things in a horrible cycle. If things stay that way, it's never going to get better. So what's happened is men said, you know what? I'm going to get better on my own. Men are starting to go their own way. You know, all of these movements are starting to be true. MGTOW and SYSBM. Now you see why these movements are here. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, be sure to check out my content. And guys, all I know, there's definitely more to life than this. That's what the channel is about. See you next video.